Behind me is is the Evita Saperon, a darling station. But the whole area used to be as as dua as the piece I'm standing on. We call it Afghanistan. This is the piece of land that the whole community of Darling cross when they go to the bank or the bottle store or the spa. And we thought, what a wonderful surprise for Tani Evita, because she doesn't know, if the community and Keith get together and put a park in here. We'll have a little playground for kids. We've got lots of kids. Um, we've got benches, lovely benches, where people can sit. And if they have too much top, they don't have to fall in the street and vomit. They can fall in the park and, and be on the grass. Basically, it is just to celebrate the fact that this is a community that is really looking forward to living together and making everything work for them. And of course, very importantly, the community will plant. Well, we've got a rough sort of sketch here, which is very rough at this stage, but it's going to basically then incorporate the pathway, uh, the heating area, lighting, uh, the indigenous plants, and um, and then we're going to get the community involved in helping us dig holes and plant. Is that yes, right? Yes, absolutely. Well. Dit is een programma voor Kids Decor. We gaan je inspireren om schepend in jouw huis te wees zonder om baar geld uit te geven. We gaan met papier werken, we gaan met lap werken, we gaan met alles bouwen we scattered cushions werken. Decor is kinderspelletjes hier bij ons. Dus ik moet het huis huis noemen. En we gaan je definitief laten verdrinken kleur. It's gonna be darling, darling. Come, you look, get, get active here, yeah. get active. Yeah. I dig, 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 digging around. Dig, 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 digging the ground. I got my space. Well, the day has finally arrived, and over many Wolf Berber, who's in charge of technical things here at the Peron, has been incredibly busy getting ready for today. Will, you've had unbelievable help from people. I have. We've, we first had a very very good response from the Swatman municipality that without taking too long immediately gave us four street lights and connected it to the street light reticulation of the town which is would be the place and from there sponsorships for just about every facet of this park came through okay ladies let's go let's grab our plants and let's go Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. With me is Elton de Villiers, who's the sales manager of the Stodal's Belleville branch. Elton, what sort of plants have we actually got? Um, we um, sponsored some Cazanias, Pentas, a wild garlic, which is an indigenous plant, very hardy. Mm -hmm. It's also mean low maintenance. Yeah. So we see I've got a dry spot here, so they will survive this type of conditions. Frankie. You're a star, my friend. Yeah, you're a star. Uh, yeah. Now, 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 can you start planting us? Oh, God. Right, start I planting. Will. Yeah, Frankie's going to plant. I will, I will, I will. Turf Ag have sponsored all this amazing irrigation material and the pop-up sprinklers or whatever. And Anthony, you're from Steve's Electrical. Steve's Electrical, yeah. Is that a Darling-based company? Darling-based company. And, and you guys installed this thing? Yeah, we installed. Turf Ag supplied the stuff and we installed it. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. What is in here? What's in here? Some seeds. Some seeds. Hey, Amen. Let me open it in here. Yeah, can we just open that? Let's see what's in there. Oh, my goodness. Economy packets of Cosmos and Marigolds. Oh, this is wonderful. And what else? And, and seeds to attract the birds. There's some herbs there. And some herbs as well. Asher Tools came to the party and they've donated two great wheelbarrows, lots of rakes, spades, forks, trowels, hand forks. So we really are grateful to Lasher. Good tools, aren't they? Yeah. Okay, and now put down, firm down nicely. That's great. Country and Book League of giving, keeping everyone fed and watered here with the cool drinks and whatever. And Kirsten Fufur, can you believe that? I mean, as this is Kirsten Bosch Tuer, as Evita has said, they have just delivered the sand to fill up that plinth under the windmill. Malmesbury Nursery has arrived. They've arrived. George, what's work for you? It's a mooi plant to have. Yes, yes, that's good for you. Nee, maar dat is goed ons nodig hulle. We 
We need a name for the God. Don't you think you should call oh, it? Darling God. Darling God. Please. That's nice. Indeed. This is uh, basically tissue cultured hybrids. Uh, tissue cultured tissue hybrids, cultured right? Hybrids from King's Plants, darling. King's These Plants, are, darling, as well. Yes. You are such a darling. Oh. Now, Michael, you're from Darling Painters. That's correct. I mean, everything's Darling here. I mean, it's Darling yes. Guest House, Darling Painters, Darling Electrical, all sorts of people. Anyway, what are we doing here? <clears throat> well, basically, we're preparing the tower at the moment for painting, and that's going to be painted pink, the, the, the top colour, the main So we're color. giving in. We're giving in. We, we're did, giving we in. weren't going to let her have pink. Here comes the Land Rover, and it's coming, it's coming. I think we should, I'm going to go and meet the Land Rover. Why are you giving away a Land Rover? Well, I can tell you, I've made such a lot of friends driving Land Rovers, having Land Rovers, fixing Land Rovers. I'm a Land Rover lover. Yeah. And uh, I think if somebody else can have such a lot of fun out of a Land Rover, then I can have it. They can have this Land Rover. Some interested artists around here will be just painting the whole thing. We're leaving that side open to a bit of advertising for HWM Motors that sponsored it. From, from Darling. From Darling. Everybody from Darling. I mean, this is a Darling place. This is one of the most famous artists in the country, not only in the Cape, but the whole country. And also all these wonderful people from the ANC, that's the Arts and Crafts, the ANC from the Peron in Darling. And you're busy. What's it going to be? Flowers? It's going to be flowers and funky and bright colors. We haven't seen the sky so blue. The birds are singing. I got nothing to do. Hey, 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 hey. It's just a sunny day. Oh, yes. And you're about to pin the sky. I'll dream them up and watch my day dreams go by. Hey, 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 hey. It's just a sunny day. That, will we? I can see that you are a community spirited individual and you've certainly thrown your full weight behind this project. What do you think it really means for the community? The local community feels definitely from the response that we've got while we worked there the past month preparing it that this place that they do feel is theirs because they use it on a daily basis is being made beautiful and they come and ask questions and what is this and are we going to have benches and will there be plants and may we sit here and may we use it and is it just part of this or is it is it for the community or is it in the so the response has been wonderful and the excitement from the community side has been wonderful so it has been a joy so it's a healing involved. in a way as well and bringing the communities together yes. i would hope so i would hope that it would have that effect and that would everyone would would want to take care of it together mm. and indeed let me tell you this this is a garden for us all. Well, this is the moment we've been waiting for. Everybody's in anticipation because Evita has arrived. We do have another lady statue in the garden as well. But Evita has arrived to cut the ribbon and open and declare the garden of Darling open. Open Kirsten Bos Tweer. Oh, thank you. Inspired by Keith Kirsten. And as near as a cactus is. So. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. It's part of the heritage and also just the, the enjoyment and, and the very important thing of making the town one because traditionally ach my liever are the oda for jegebore when there was a part that you won't remember it but then of course there was a color town and a white town now this oh, is one of the last steps to actually make it one town in and there's nothing as as wonderful as something that that appeals to young people every cloud has a silver lining the World Cup continues, and we're 100% behind you. 
Watch our boys make a comeback. SABC3, your ticket to the ICC Cricket World Cup. This week's Mamepe takes the road less travelled and lands up in the free state Nochal. Ritiana Lili Ship Shearers have a lake out there record in Chile Fazi. From the not so furry sheep, we head off to discover the charms and hidden attractions of Bochabelo. Ribera Copanelibo Raha Bobai, Tailing, Babo Pandi, Bat Salt, Sikalitsuai. See the free state like never before. Watch Mamepe Thursday night, 8 30 on SABC2. And anybody, all can, they can here sit and sing and dance, or drunk word and sachies on the ground near plants, yeah. and then they don't get driven over by a tractor in the main road. And so there we are, and it's really come together very nicely. And I think the community have really been involved and embraced it, and it's going to grow and mature. The plants are still very young, but in five or so years' time, we'll look at it and it'll be like an established garden. Well, I had to chat this week with Evita Besodnote about how the garden was getting on down at Darling, the community one that we did some two months ago. And she tells me that it's looking really, really terrific. The
pumpkins. Yeah. Um, Keith, if you have a look at the, the tomatoes just now, we have a little little tomato that has got an excellent taste. We'll probably bring into our range soon. Mm -hmm. um, it's a little red tomato, like a cherry tomato, with an excellent taste. And uh, that's just come about. We have selected that variety out of a, out of a, a background of, um, in terms of our breeding program, and uh, have brought it forward into the range. Well, there you have it. The Ostenburg trial grounds here of Stark Airs, outside Cape Town, performance tested, technology in a packet, all great stuff, and the sun's coming out. My choice of plant of the week this week is an evergreen amaryllis lily, and it's almost unusual to be talking about amaryllis at this time of the year because they normally flower in August, September, and October in the spring and early summer. But this evergreen one is known as a pink flamingo. It has this white, white stripe down the leaf, and it has these brilliant bells of bright pink flowers which unfold in February and in March of each year, right through almost, in fact, to May. So the nice thing about it is that when the flowers are finished, you've still got a bowl of beautiful foliage being evergreen. And when they're finished flowering, it's also the time to keep feeding them. And there's nothing like nitrosol, which is the high nitrogen fertilizer to feed them and get the foliage really looking great. And that'll get them into good speed for when they're gonna flower next year. So that's the Hippiastrum Pink Flamingo, my plant of the week. Well, unfortunately, that's all for this week. Next week, we give you an update of our trial garden. We talk to Jessie Walton in her indigenous garden in Elgin. We talk to Paul Funk about winter and spring bulbs. And we give you an update of what vegetables to be planting for winter and spring. So make sure next week, Down to Earth with Keith Kirsten. Until then, happy gardening.